President Bill Clinton with us. And uh, I, I know we're told that you have one more. I have to ask you because you delivered the commencement address in 1996 at Penn State. And just your overall thoughts at what transpired there. Well, if the allegations are true, it's a heartbreaking thing. And I love Penn State. You know, my my father-in-law played football at Penn State and graduated from there. One of my brothers-in-law played football at Penn State and graduated from there. I have always had the highest respect for Coach Paterno, and I still do. But this is a horrible deal, and my view is you just need to see it through. The, the personnel decisions have been made, but now you just need to see it through, find out what the truth is, do the right thing, and if you do that, then the good will emerge again. You know, Penn State is a great university. You've got great athletic programs, and I've seen all these other athletic programs get in trouble when yours didn't. And the enduring truth, the enduring legacy, the positive things that have happened will reemerge, but they cannot reemerge until you just get to the bottom of what happened and let the law take its course and everybody follow the do-right rule. And when it's done, then you can, you know, put the house back together. It's still a great place. And, you know, Joe Paterno had a great life there, and he did great, great things there. And I think, you know, just don't want to mix the two things up. Nobody's saying that's not true and can't be acknowledged. But we need to find out who knew what, when, who did what, when, who was supposed to do what, and what actually happened. Then the law can take its course, 